What's going on guys? This is Nubby with One Hand Tech, back with another unboxing for you. Uh, today we got another rework station from the people over at Aoyu. This is a 968A+. Plus. Uh, I think it's one of their mid to high range uh, rework stations. Uh, I've already undone the tape on the top just so I wouldn't have to do it during the video. Um, let's dive right in and see what you get. Let me take a look around the box. And here's just some contact information for AOU. Here's all the different model numbers with the ones that I have highlighted. I have the 968A plus and it's the 110 volt version. Very plain box pretty much. Here it has a couple of features uh, and applications. It's a multi-function system and we'll see more about that when we get inside. Let's start taking things out. Open the box, you get, and this is an instruction manual on how to put together the uh, soldering iron holder. You get the instruction manual for the 968A Plus itself. And here's a soldering iron stand. Real nice, heavy metal stop. Uh, soldering iron holder. Really nice quality seems like. Uh, box inside of a box. We'll put that off to the side and look at that here in a second. There we got the unit itself. And that looks to be about it. Alright, now we have this little box that came inside the big box. We'll see what kind of stuff comes in here. Uh, we get an IC popper. Looks like it has two different uh, sizes of attachments for the different size uh, chips that you might have. Uh, extra extra ceramic heating element. You get a, a thing of different sizes and types of tips for your soldering iron. Get a holder for your hot air gun. Here's the tray and the sponge for your soldering iron holder. And here looks like to be a bag of uh, hot air gun nozzles. And it's another black piece in there for something. I'm not sure what that is. We'll look, take a look at that when we get inside. Uh, this looks like a hose for the fume extractor. Or maybe the suction tool for the IC suction tool. Uh, cable, power cable for the unit. A soldering iron, and it has the uh, fume extractor already attached, so that other one must be the, the IC suction tool. And then there's an extra heating element for the hot air gun. Alright, just to have a little bit of a recap of everything that you get inside the little box that was inside the big box. Now that I got everything open, we can see it. You get your power cord for the unit, your extra heating element for your hot air gun, extra ceramic heating element for your soldering iron. You get five different size uh, hot air nozzles. You get the holder for your hot air nozzle back here in the back. You get another uh, filter for the air pump and it's an open and a free flowing air filter. Uh, you get your suction, IC suction tool with three different size suction tips. You get your soldering iron with the fume extractor. You get the IC popper and it has two different sizes of attachments that goes with it. And you get 10 total different soldering iron tips. Uh, you get nine in the bag, one comes on the soldering iron already, and it seems like there is three different types of tips that come with the unit itself. Now here we have the soldering iron holder, and I have it all put together. This little tray came in that little box as well, and I went ahead and attached it to the holder itself. And inside the holder in the back here, you get this little piece here for... Uh, to hold your solder with it while it's still on the spool 
and this this soldering iron holder is really heavy duty steel construction and it's got a it's got a nice weight to it and rubber feet so it's not going to slide around too easy on the bench and it's got a nice big sponge here for you to keep your tip clean on your soldering iron and this little bracket here that holds the solder can mount on either side it's just got two two little screws in there that go into threaded and it's got threads on the sides already that you can mount it on either side that you want it on now here we have the 968 a plus unit itself uh, we got the hot air gun here uh, this little nozzle here is for your IC popper or fume extractor it's where you plug the hose in and it sucks air in through there you got your soldering iron connector it's where you plug your soldering iron into you got a little calibration thing here for your soldering iron this knob is for controlling the temperature of your soldering iron you got three switches here the first one is to turn on and off your soldering iron the second one is to turn on and off the air pump for the IC suction tool or the uh, fume extractor on your soldering iron uh, this third switch is for the hot air gun this knob here is to adjust the airflow in both the hot air gun as well as the suction part for the IC uh, suction tool or the fume extractor. We got an old school display here for airflow. This is for the digital display for the hot air gun you can increase and decrease the temperature here and it'll read out the, dis the temperature there this display displays the temperature of the soldering iron and there's really nothing on either side of the unit if you go around to the back you have a power switch here you got your uh, mains input there and a fuse on the mains input here go around to the other side again there's nothing all right, now that we got everything out of the box and unwrapped and put together, now I was going to put it all back together here in one pile. That way you guys can see what it all comes in the box with the 968A+. Uh, to recap again, you get 10 assorted soldering tips. You get five different sizes and shapes of air gun nozzles. You get a spare heating element for both the soldering iron as well as the hot air gun. You get an IC popper with two different size tips on it. You get an extra filter and plug for the suction. You get a IC suction tool. You get the power cord. You get the 968A plus unit itself that has the hot air gun attached to it already. You get a soldering iron with the fume extractor and you get the soldering iron holder. Uh, that's what all you get with the 968A Plus from AOU. Uh, that's going to do it for the unboxing. I'll have the review coming shortly. And we're going to do a teardown of this unit as well. And see what all is inside. And look at the craftsmanship. Uh, stay tuned for those. If you could, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And that'll be it for now.